a fucking joint, right? And these producers is giving me like the hardest time right now. Like I've never seen no shit like this before. Like I know niggas cannot, can, it can't be that bad outside, my nigga. It can't be that bad outside, my nigga. It can't, bro. I done made over half a million for the year. It can't be that bad outside, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, why is niggas ODing right now? Like, I'm supposed to drop my project anyway. Let me get straight to it. I'm trying to drop my project. But these niggas are asking me clearances. And these fucking producers is asking for some crazy shit. I don't know what rumors is going around. They think, like, oh, Bobby just dropping bags. This, this, that, whatever. I'm not giving niggas no fucking... $10,000, $8,000 for no fucking producer song, bitch. I mean, who the fuck told you niggas to fucking make songs with 10 motherfuckers on the song, bitch? Nigga, fucking send me some buck. Yo, bu yo, yo, bum ass niggas can send me some shit like that with like 10 niggas on the song, bro. Don't, don't, don't play me, bro. Don't play me, bro. I'm not like, like, y'all niggas gonna bust your gun by yourself, nigga. You know I mean? Man, I could, <laughs> this nigga Bobby Smurf the funniest, I don't know what, bro. Like, this nigga said, man, y'all niggas. But see, I'm gonna tell you what the problem is with the um the producers nowadays. Not the problem, but what's the difference is what he's talking about. It be so many producers collabing with so many loop makers and like just how Kanye do. It be 12 people on the end of the song, the production. Eight of them not even in the song at all. They just press the key. Or, it be a lot of collabing going on. So yeah, I feel him on that, man. But Bobby funny as I don't know what, man. <laughs>